Hello everyone, my name is Ronnie Godoy and I'm an Applications Engineer here at Hawkridge Systems. In today's short video, we're going to take a look at a new enhancement in 2018. We are now able to hide faces while creating mates. In our assembly here, we're going to go ahead and go to our mate tool. And this new feature in 2018 allows us to hide our faces of our components in order to select entities that are obscured or that are behind those faces. For example, I have this top here that I want to go ahead and make the bottom face coincident with the, this face here of my model. And so instead of rotating or moving my model around, I can simply just move my cursor over the face I want to hide, press the Alt key, and that's going to allow me to now select entities that are behind that face that I just hid. So now I have the ability, you'll see that I can select that bottom face there, and then I can select this face here to accomplish that coincident relationship that I'm looking for. So you could imagine how much easier it's going to be to create these mates now, especially mates like our with mate. Instead of struggling with selecting the outer boundaries and the inner boundaries of this with mate, I can now hide these faces. So select my outer boundaries here, press move my cursor over this face, press the Alt key to hide it, and then select that face there. And then we'll go ahead and select our tab selections here. I'll go ahead and hide this face here in order to select that back face. And you'll see how quick and easy it is to now create our with me. Now, not only do we have the option of hiding these faces, but I could also take it a step further. And as I'm hiding my faces, let's say for example, this one, I could keep pressing the Alt key as many times as I need to hide additional faces behind whatever, wherever my cursor is pointing to. So in this case, I kept pressing Alt key until I no longer have any faces to hide. And one of the neat things with this tool is I could undo that, meaning I could go ahead and show my faces again. So we could toggle these on and off. The way I would show my faces is by holding down the shift key while pressing the Alt key. And I press that as many times as I need to continue adding these faces back on. So you see that this ability or this functionality allows us to work a lot more efficient while we're creating these mates here. Now this capability is not only available when we create a new mate, but it's also available when we edit our mates. If we're going to copy our mates or use our mated entities tool, we're also able to hide our faces while using those tools. So in today's video, we took a look at a new enhancement in 2018. We're able to toggle those faces on and off using the Alt key and the Shift Alt key. If you enjoyed this video, make sure you take, you take a look at our YouTube channel and subscribe to it. Ch check a look at our blog and make sure you like this video down below.